Number 1. Edna's Filipino Cuisine From pork cracklings to Filipino spaghetti to fried rice, Edna's Filipino Cuisine is a casual stop with serious options, including a whole lechon. Just a note, Edna's crew needs a week's notice to roast a whole roast pig to eat at home, so plan accordingly. Number 2. Amatoli Mediterranean Bites Owners Dima and Sam Hababaya's downtown Long Beach restaurant Amatoli has a menu straight from the Levant region that encompasses Iraq, Syria, Lebanon, Cyprus, Turkey, Israel, Jordan, and Palestine, with dishes that have a familiar and delicious Mediterranean ring. The details are beautiful, with tea service, gorgeous dishes, and plates to display the fare. Number 3 Sura Korean Barbecue and Tofu House while Sura may not compete with some of Koreatown's finest dining gems, one of Long Beach's only Korean restaurants does just fine by introducing the community to bubbling tofu soups, bibimbap, plus Korean tacos and soaps. Anything to save a trip up north to K-Town or south to Garden Grove. Number 4 Robert Earl's Barbecue Be patient when ordering at Robert Earl's Barbecue, a laid-back, family-owned restaurant on the north end of Long Beach. Those rib tips are particularly tender, and because they all shine, it's impossible to decide which side dishes to order. Number 5 La Esperanza Restaurant Adriana Moran opened Torrance's La Esperanza Bakery in 1994, with a second storefront operating right in the center of Long Beach as of 2017. Moran continues to serve Guatemalan and Salvadoran dishes in a cozy setting even as Long Beach's bakery scene continues to explode. Number 6 V-Burger With a menu that's full of plant-based burger joint classics, V-Burger has impossible or beyond meat burgers on deck, along with breakfast sandwiches, mac and cheese, quesadillas, and milkshakes. If that's not enough, they also operate a vegan creperie next door. Number 7 Phnom Penh Noodle Shack Phnom Penh Noodle Shack started out as a five-seat restaurant in 1985 and eventually worked up to being a neighborhood favorite that's filled with families on weekends. The local restaurant is right in the heart of Long Beach's Cambodia town, offering some of city's best rice porridge, stir-fry noodles, noodles and soup, and the classic Cambodian B.A. Bang. Number 8. Aji Peruvian Cuisine when walking or driving by Aji Peruvian Cuisine after 6 p.m. Any day, the place will likely be packed. The family-operated business opened in 2014, where Peruvian staples line the menu. The ceviches are a must, as well as the Causa de Camarones. Number 9 Gusto Bread Head baker Arturo Enciso prepares far more than just bread at Gusto. Long before moving into in a larger space in 2020, the Long Beach Bakery garnered national attention for its pastries, pools, baguettes, and cookies. Stop by to take a look at the day's inventory, or head to the website for pre-orders. Number 10 and J Seafood Shack And J Seafood Shack owner Vanek Tan's 280-square-foot stall produces a slew of fantastic dishes including family Cambodian recipes, along with traditional from Phnom Penh to Oahu's North Shore. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.